Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's uh, Silver101 coming at you again. Um, thought I'd give you a uh, silver update here. Um, I, You know what? I didn't even count it, so I don't know how much I have. Uh, but I figured I'd show everybody what I got here. Um, I said I was going to do full stack gold video, but you know what? Never keep my gold on hand, so I have to go get that at the uh, places where I keep it. So probably do one in a couple days. But uh, my silver, uh, might as well just show you that start off I guess by showing you uh, the junk I got or the pre-64 so over here these are all dimes we got two four six eight ten and then just a little bag of silver dimes here and some barber and other dimes in here oh that, that is a nickel I think yeah how that nickel get in there well I think they're all dimes oh, maybe they're all yeah Okay, so, oh, a little grab bag, I guess. thought they were dimes. I put them in there. Anyways, there's the dimes. Then I got some uh, quarters going on here. See? Uh, hmm. Count one. Oh. Two. Huh. Oh, here's one of the year. Okay, 64 year. Yeah, they're all nothing special here. These are quarters, and then I got my uh, half dollars. Uh, yeah. a roll of these. Well, I don't know if that's a roll, but got a little tube of those. Got some Kennedys, 64s. Some of those. And then I got some of these too. Uh, these are quarters, no? Half dollars, my bad. Okay. And then my dollars. This is the, uh, I really, actually, I really like this stuff and I, I want to get more of it. Um, i been buying a lot of gold and so. I haven't picked up a lot of silver, but I'll show you what I do have. And uh, start with the uh, standard. My uh, Canadian Maple Leafs. I've uh, kept them all in their... Uh, air tights ever since I got them it doesn't look like any of them have started to spot and I hear that's supposed to be an issue oh well, maybe this one it's supposed to be an issue with the uh, Canadian Maple Leafs from my understanding and actually that's just the uh, case it's not the coin itself I don't know if you could tell they're all in outstanding condition though haven't had an issue with milk spawning now that's just a glare on any of these coins See? Just a glare. Coins are in excellent condition. Right. Knock on wood. Okay. And then I got my American Eagles here. Let's get a good look at those. These are the American Eagles here. And these are the uh, Maple Leafs here. There you go. A little closer. And uh, I'm real fortunate about these uh, American Eagles too. All staying, you know. Not starting to get uh, usual wear, you know, coins do. Like I said, every time I get a coin, I throw it in airtight. Obviously, except for the uh, junk silver I got going on over here. But, you know, I love the look and feel of these things. You know, these things are awesome. Anyways, go back over here American Eagles. And I got these two. These were the actual two coins I ever, ever purchased. A place called Littleton Coin Company. And these actually do have, do have a, see? Starting to turn a little bit over there. Top. Figured if I kept them in the uh, containers I got them in, they'd be okay. So this is pretty cool. 
These were, got these years and years and years ago before I was actually uh, collecting uh, into the actual precious metals, uh, gold and silver. This was just uh, when I was younger. I, I liked coins, I liked uh, you know silver coins as well. I got two of them, and I think that was all I got. And again, I've had them for quite a while, so that's all I have, really. Those two from Littleton Coin Company. I don't know if their Littleton is still around. They might be. But I think they mainly deal with numismatic uh, coins. I don't think they deal with a. Well, at least back then, they dealt with a gold and silver. Okay, and then I guess I could show you a little wildlife series I got going on here. Well, I really don't have the series. I just have a couple of coins. Canna. Not sure what animal that is. Bison, elk. Let's see here if it says. Nope. Just Elizabeth, queen. Fine silver. I should know, but I don't. Okay. Let's see here. This. I think this is a moose, though. <laughs> Pretty sure I got that one. Got that nice coin, and then I got a. I think this is a bison. If I'm not mistaken. It's a State Farm commercial, or is that not right? Or that's a buffalo. Actually, there we go. With that one, and then the eagle. Beautiful as always. But I think that's an eagle. Maybe it's a hawk. I don't know my birds of prey. Hmm. It's alright. And there we go. That. And then I got my sharks. I got five of these little things. I believe they're uh, half ounces. Wow, not coming in. Sorry about that. Hmm. There we go. These are really nice coins, too. But uh, I don't think I'll be getting any more of them. Not big into getting the half ounce size coins, but I do like these sharks. They're pretty cool. Okay. Five of those. Great white sharks. It's pretty sick with the two other sharks in the background. It's actually a really, really cool looking coin. I don't know if they have those in one ounces. Maybe if they did, I'd grab some. I'm not sure if they do. Anyways, uh, let's go on to my two slap coins. I got this. It's a an NGC. Um, it's MS70, I guess. Not sure about NGC. I know PCGS or. I can't remember. Well, actually, that's a PCGS, but anyways, thought I'd show you this one. So it has the L Atmex sticker on it, and it's a nice coin. Yeah, I think I might want to sell it. If anyone's interested in it, let me know. I'm going to open it up, sell the plastic, you know, shoot me at a fair price, and or maybe I'll keep it. I don't know. I'm not sure. I don't know. If somebody throws me at a fair price, I'll probably sell it. It's a nice coin. I think I traded actually four American Eagles for that. I traded four of these things. Four American Eagles for this coin right here. Maybe I'll sell it and get four more American Eagles. Okay, and let's go to the uh, to these horses here. Let's see here. It's a roll of six uh, half ounces. Though. I said I didn't have many half ounce coins, but I guess I had more than I thought. Anyways. Six of these, and then well, let's check this qual out first. These things are really nice. Yeah, keep that down. These things are really nice. Wow, really like that. I think I'm gonna pick up more koalas in time, but uh, not right now. Wow, even in front of that, I really like that. Okay, and then my pandas. One. Only got three pandas, so not too big of a deal here. Three one ounces. 
Beautiful coins, though. I guess at the local coin store I bought them from, the guy was selling me the uh, mints are all out of them. But I guess you can go online and still get these. I don't know what mint they were talking about. Maybe where they're actually made. Anyways, you could always get these on that max. I've seen them there hundreds of times. And then my one ounce horses. I only got three of those too. But I got that bad boy, which is a new buy. It's a two ouncer. Pretty cool coin, I think. Two ounce, two ounce silver. That's pretty cool. Never owned a uh, coin bigger than the one ounce variety. I'm glad I got this though. It's two ounce. There are two ounce. And half ounce. That's pretty cool. Oops. A little, a little horse stack. Half ounce over here. Anyways. There's the silver horses. And here's the pandas. Oh, and you know what? I think I forgot to show this. This is pretty cool. It's uh, Walking Liberty, American Eagle. West Point Mint, First Strike, but it's PR69. I don't know what that means. I think the higher the grade, the uh, better condition, I guess. I don't know. So I guess the uh, 70 would be uh, the top. I think that's how that works, but anyways, comment, let me know. I'm still learning. One ounce fine silver, United States. I think this is really nice. That's why I got this coin. Anyways, uh, those are the two slapped coins I got. Uh, don't really not into the slab coins, but I couldn't resist this one. Uh, this one I'm definitely not going to sell. So cool looking. Wow. Love that coin. Beautiful coin. So shiny I could see myself. Wow. Anyways. Go on to my uh, bars here. And uh, this is the uh, first bar, first piece of silver I ever purchased actually. Actually, let me take that back. When I first started getting into the, uh, not the collection side, which uh, I think a long time ago I had gotten these, but I wasn't really into coin collecting. I got a bunch of state quarters too, but uh, I don't think those really count. Uh, these were actually my two first, but when it comes to, you know, silver, you know, obtaining silver, you know, to offset inflation, preservation of wealth, this was my uh, first purchase actually. It was a Johnson Matthew bar. Pretty cool little bar. I like it. It came in plastic. Ain't gonna take it out of this plastic, wouldn't make any sense. Uh, jam. And then I bought that, right? I went back a week later and I got this. Ten of these. The guy was trying to sell me a whole sheet. But I only purchased a ten. Which I'm super glad I did, though. Silvertown. Really cool. You know, I bought these. You know. Silvertown bars. The miner with his uh, mule or donkey, same thing, I guess. Super cool coins. Flip that over again, and then you know what? Funny, I like them so much, and I think I started getting hooked on the silver. I actually went back the next week and I got this. So I had gotten this. This is a 10 ounce, by the way. There's supposed to be some security feature on here. I'm supposed to be able to buy a card. I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking at. I don't have the card. Make sure it's authentic, but I'm getting them from the same guy. 
pretty sure they're authentic. Well. And then, uh, recently I bought, got these. Uh, let's see, actually, I got these first. I got these little, these are the smallest uh, little uh, one ounce. They're pretty cool though, I like them. I like the feel of them. You know, I, I don't know. They're, well, they're, they got kind of like that poured look, but they're so smooth. You know? I can't remember where I got these from. Trying to get you a little good view. There it is. Hmm. I think it says bison bullion. I'm trying to read that bottom word. Yeah, bullion. See? Pretty cool little one ounces. But here's the ones I like the most. I just got these. Well, <laughs> I just got these. Silvertown. Or Silvertown, I'm sorry. Scottsdale Silvers. Bars are one ounce bars. And they're, they came in these plastic cases. Uh... I guess when I got them from him, uh, he had 10 originally, and I said, no, nah, I only went five, and I left, and then I just went back today, and he sold three of them, so I got the last two he had. I guess he snoozy lose, right? I wanted to get a set of 10, but I only got five, and they all are in these plastic cases. It's really nice. You know? I guess these cases actually cost like an extra two bucks online. But uh, he sold them to me just for the, uh, I think two dollars over. Over the price of silver, I think I got them for twenty two, twenty two sixty or twenty two something. At the time, I think silver was just at twenty. It's at twenty fifty eight, I think today. But these are really cool. So I got seven of these, and I don't know if I'm going to be fortunate enough to uh, get another two. But anyways. I'm happy with what I have. These are all my silver bars. This is my little silver bar section right here. Definitely want to get more silver bars. I'm not sure if I'm going to be getting the higher, the bigger sizes. They are beautiful though. They got a really nice feel to them. You know, you know you have a piece of silver in your hand there. But uh, that's those. So shiny. See, I'm uh, filming off my handy dandy phone here. But anyways, this is my silver stack. Uh, I guess I have about 40, 43, 44, 45, 45 eagles. So that's 45 ounces, 45, let's just say 55, 62, 72, 72, let's see here, 72, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 is 80. This is the half. So 80, uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 9, 89, 90, 91, 92, right? I don't know if I miscounted, but anyways, uh, 92 ounces of silver. Uh, my goal is to, I guess, hit 500. I guess I'm going rather slow. I have been accumulating a lot of gold though, and I will be doing a uh, full ounce gold video. But I wanted to throw this out there before I did my uh, gold video and show y'all what I have accumulated in uh, silver. Don't get me wrong, I really like silver. Like I said, I really like silver, but I love gold. So uh, I'll be doing a gold video, show y'all what I got. But here's my silver, and hope you enjoy it comment subscribe uh all that good stuff uh youtube this is uh, shover 101 y'all take care